So this is how we can convert pages to PDF on the iPad. Let's get into it. Right, so whenever you open up the Pages app, you can continue with your existing projects or you can begin a brand new one. So that's pretty obvious, right? But these documents are going to be in the docs or in the Word format. However, if you want to convert or export those into the PDF format, luckily it is all built into the Pages application because whenever you are done with the with the document, what you can click on is the share icon in the top right corner. And this will give you the ability to just export it. So at first, I, you can always just choose between collaboration and sending a copy. So most likely you want to send the copy, right? But below you have the export and a send button. And when you tap on this, it gives you the ability to choose a specific format you want to go with. So quite literally, the first one is the PDF. So if that is apparently what you're interested in, you can tap on this and your document will be finished in a PDF file. So you can now copy it. You can share it through AirDrop, uh, mail, notes, whatever it might be. But also you have the option to save it to your Dropbox, local iPad files, Google Drive, or essentially anything else that you might have available. So that's how it kind of works. Of course, if you already have a finished like pages document, you can always use the online conversion tool where you just upload the file and just have it converted online and download it as a PDF. That might be useful to you, but personally using pages and exporting it in PDF is quite literally the best option if you ask me. So that's it. That's everything I wanted to show you. Hit the thumbs up if you found this video helpful. Most definitely subscribe for more because I have a bunch of videos about the pages on the iPad. So go ahead and check it out if you are interested. But that's it. Thanks a lot for your support and I'll see you in later in the future tutorials. <laughs>